But you see, everything that glitters is not gold. And that certainly is true of our contemporary Christianity. Glitters. Man, if ever Christianity glittered, it is today. Evangelism that commands the attention of countless hundreds of thousands, millions, tens of millions of people. Glitters. Man, did it ever glitter? But it's nothing more than multi-billion dollar show business. Where the gospel isn't designed to address the human disaster, the human remedy for that disaster, the human dilemma, or God's remedial measures. It's designed only to satisfy the carnal appetites of people who want to dance to the gospel, who want to visualize, dream it out, name it and claim it, positive thinking. If you want a million dollars, all you've got to do is visualize. It'll be yours the week after next. We've got a form of religion. It's called Christianity. Soul music. Christian rock, of course, no such thing any more than there's Christian drugs. Or Christian uh, promiscuous sex. Unless you simply want to gather folks under your roof and offer it and put a new label on, that's all. Give them the same stuff they can get down the road. They get it cheaper in church. That's all. It has nothing to do with Christianity. Because as I trust you've already gathered, you've never ever before, and some of you, of course, have, Christianity is Christ in unity. In the person of his Holy Spirit. But you see we've turned the evangel into jukebox religion. Where you play to the gallery. The only important thing that matters is how many people you get. To listen to you and how much they're going to put in the offering. That's all that matters. They deny the power thereof. 